Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hi, teacher. How are you? I am fine. And you? Good. Good. What about you, Eric? How are you? Diana, how are you? Fine, thank you. What about you? Oh, I'm okay. Thank you. It's hot. Yes. It's yes. raining? Is it raining in your house? No. Uh, a little. Here in San Salvador, it's raining. Here in San Salvador, no. No? No. Um, <laughs> wait five, ten minutes. Mm. Hello, Patty. And hello, Daisy. Hi, good evening. How are you? <coughs> Perdón. <laughs> it's okay. I am fine, thank you. All right. How was your day today? Good? How was your weekend? Very boring. It was boring. Yes. Why? I stay home all day, all week. Oh, yeah. Well, now he stopped. Now, I put in Yes, but he's not but, sure. Yeah, but don't. If it's not necessary, don't. Mm -hmm. Yes. Today, I only went to the bank. Only, and it was okay. Near supermarket, only. Only, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Hello, Eric, are you there? Tell me, Eric. Eric is sleeping. And Diana? Oh, it's Monday. Monday. Eh, dice que por cuestiones personales no pude ingresar a la plataforma y me salí el miércoles de la semana pasada media clase y el jueves no pude entrar. Eh, ya están apareciendo las clases en, en YouTube. Mm, no, fíjese que lo voy a ser sincero, no ha chequeado. ¿A alguien ya les está apareciendo. Alguien ha chequeado. Yo revisé como el lunes para ver las clases de la semana anterior, Ajá. pero no vi, no la vi eh, subida la clase. Okay. Pero lo que veo que en la, página, en la página de inglés corporativo como que suben la grabación de las clases. Eso medio he visto yo. Pero en YouTube no. No, YouTube sí no he revisado. Ok, déjame chequear. Mañana, en el transcurso de la mañana voy a chequear yo eso. Y la otra pregunta que le quería hacer era, con la plataforma, eh, ¿a qué nivel más o menos tendríamos que ir ya de acuerdo al tiempo que llevamos en, esta, en este módulo? Vamos a entrar ya a la sección 2 del nivel del primero, al 2.1. Ah. O sea, están en inglés, permítame, ahorita le voy a decir. Aunque yo siempre le voy a recomendar algo. A veces no se preocupen tanto en el nivel, sino de qué tan el, el progreso que van. Ajá. Porque yo le voy a ser sincero. Mi esposa estudió en la UCA. Antes yo la conociera como dos años y medio, creo. Y no... No, o sea, ella me decía, soy nivel avanzado porque así le daban el diploma. Pero no era ni 
Y no era culpa de ella, sino que era... El método de aprendizaje. Ajá. No tanto que a veces también no el método, pero sino que como va avanzando la clase, a mí no me gusta, no sé si han dado cuenta, pero no me gusta mucho ir avanzando al siguiente tema si no, no entendemos el primero. Porque después hay temas súper fáciles de que se pueden hacer en dos días. Por ejemplo, lo que vamos a hacer hoy. Uh -huh. eh, son cinco secciones. De, estamos ya en la dos. Del pre, del pre intermedio. Hello. Sí, sí, sí. Gracias, gracias. Sí. No, ok, no, no problema. Ok. Um, Last week, what did we practice? Do you remember? Add in on. In on and at. Yes. In time and place, correct? Yes. Okay, what else did we practice? ¿Qué más hicimos last week? In, on, and at. Good evening. Hello, good evening. I'm sorry, I have a problem with my routers. No problem, it happens. Okay, thank you. No, okay, um, so what did we practice last week? Do you remember? Okay, so let's see la semana pasada. In, on, and at. Yes. Really? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, in, on, and at? Yes. Seguro no hicimos otras cosas. Como practicar, my name is, where are you from, what do you do? Ah, yes. Question. <laughs> yes. WH questions. WH questions. Good. Remember the WH questions, for example? Um, why, wish, what? Yeah. Okay. Um, give me one second and I will share my screen with you. Please hold. Okay, hello class. No. Hi. Hi. Let me see. Okay, look, I'm going to share my screen with you. Okay. <laughs> 
Do you see this? Yes. Okay. Three, four, five. Okay, we have six examples. We have, I'm sorry, seven examples. Please take five minutes. No, take seven minutes. One minute for every example and tell me if this is correct. My book is at the table. If it's correct, okay, no. good. No. no, no, wait, wait, no, 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 please hold on, wait, wait. Please tell me if it's correct. If it's correct, write C. If it's not correct, please write the correct form. But you, no digan nada ahorita, just, you. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, um, do you understand? Yes. Okay. So, please take seven minutes. Look at every example and tell me if. Oh, for example, look number five, six, and seven. Number five, six, and seven, please write the question. Please write the question for. So I am from Santa Tecla. Please write the question, the correct form. Okay? No, see, si, yes, we, one, hello, hi. Yes. Okay. Entendieron lo que hay que hacer? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Todos entendieron? Yes. Bueno, aparentemente solo dos personas me están oyendo. Okay, entonces, por favor, háganlo, por favor. Lo que, que yes. le demos la respuesta correcta, si la, si la oración está correcta o si no está correcta, que la corrijamos. Exacto. Lo único que el ejemplo 5, 6 y 7 son preguntas. Son, son preguntas. Entonces, no, son no voy a decir que Vamos a formular la pregunta. Ajá. Son respuestas. Hagan la pregunta. 5, eh, 6 y 7 son respuestas. Entonces, ustedes hagan la pregunta. Ok, please take your time. Lo vamos a hacer juntos. Cuando terminen.
Okay, did you finish? Okay, thank you. Let's let's check. Let's check. Okay, Brenda. Hi, Brenda. Hi. Tell me, number one, it says my book is at the table. Oh no. Grammatically, is this correct? No. No. What is the correct? My book is on the table. My book is on the table. Very good. Why? Because uh, on is a. Uh, mm, I in English. Well, or change because at is only for time. Time. The um is. Place. It's, yeah, it's on a place or on an object. Good. Somebody said this is correct. My book is at the table. So everybody put my book, it's on the table? Yes. On the table, yes. Nice. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay, yes. now let's go with Patty. Patty Amaya. I am yes. in my bedroom. Is this correct? Yes. Okay. Somebody put something different? No. Okay, very good. Yes. Yeah. Okay, good. Very good. Yes, it is. I am in my bedroom. That is the correct way. Okay, um, number three. Diana. Yes. The movie the movie starts in 9 p.m. Is this correct? No. no. What is the correct? Uh, okay, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, good. Excuse me. Um, yeah. Alguien le podría bajar a la tele o... Oh. I think it's my TV. Oh, yeah? It's your TV? Okay. Thank you, Diana. Thank you very much. But okay, look. So the movie starts in 9 p.m. or at 9 p.m.? At 9 p.m. At 9 p.m. Why not? Is it in? Is it in? In two hours. Good. In 40 minutes. Very good. Yes, the movie starts at 9 p.m. Because at is for a specific time, correct? Yes. And in is for um, approximate time. Yes. Thank you, Dana. Hilda. Yes, sir. Hi, Hilda. Are you, um, um, Hilda, can you please tell me if this is correct? Christmas is in December 25th. 25. No. It's not correct. No. Uh, I do Christmas is on December 25. Okay, mm -hmm. why on and not in? Because it's specific time. Why, I'm sorry? It's specific. What is a specific? Time, day. Yes, but why on and not in? What is the difference between on and in? Somebody help her. What is the difference between on and in? I, I think in is only used for something general. Okay. And when you uh, when you put on, is you add um, the day and the month. You're being specific, yes. Yes. Yes, thank you. Yes, Hilda, it, it is correct. Christmas is on December 25th. And the reason is because in is in general. So Christmas is in December. And this should be. 
Christmas is in December. Se vamos a usar in. But if we're going to use on, Christmas is on December 25. Okay? Okay. Somebody, okay. Alguien, alguien lo tenía como correcto? Christmas is in December 25? No. Okay, good. Um, so we can, we can use both in a uh, or uh, Yes, yes, you can use both. But there's a difference. Okay, Hilda, Hilda asked a question. We can use in and on, correct? Okay. Manuel, when do we use in? In this sentence, how do we use in? In, in this case, is on. Okay, but imagine you want in. So, what is the correct? Christmas is in December 25th. ¿Qué le quitamos? 25th. Uh, 25th. Yes. Because, Hilda, look, Christmas is in December. You're not as specific. You're being in general. Christmas is in six yeah, months. But the, the, the... La oración es December 25, so I'm correct, I'm correct or not? No, when you want to be December 25, you are being specific. When you're being specific, we say on. Okay, Hilda? Hilda? Okay. Do you understand the difference between in and on, Hilda? Yes. Okay, yes. When we say in, it's in general time, yes? Semana Santa is in... April. In April, thank you. Well, sometimes, sometimes it's in March or... But, okay, Semana Santa is in, in April. Um, and and um, or Semana Santa is on April 15, 16. It depends, no? Yeah. Yes. Father's Day is in um, is in June. Oh, Father's Day is on. Mm -hmm. June June 17. June 17. Okay, good. Um, Josue. Hi. Hi. I am from Santa Tecla. What is the correct? Yes. What is the question? The question is, where are you from? Good. Where are you from? Somebody yes. has something different? Where do you live? Mm. No. Yes, yes, but here it's is specific. I am I am from Santa Tecla because where do you live is more specific. I live in Pinares yes, yes, de Suiza. Yes. yes. No, but it's it's a good question. No problem. But remember, yeah. where do you live is more specific. Yes. Okay. okay. Um thank you, Josue. Manuel. Okay. Hi. Hi. Yes, unmarried. What is the question, sir? Uh, are you married? The question is, are you married? Very good. Yes, unmarried. Good. Uh, Jose Salvador. Yeah. Nope. She is single. What is the question? The question is, is she single? Is that correct? It, it's not correct. It's, she is not single. No. No. Oh. The correct is. She's married. Is she married? Mm -hmm. Is she married? Is she? Because look, no. She is single. This is the confirmation, right? So is okay. she married? No. She is single. But Jose Salvador, si no pregunta, is she single? No. She is single. No, she's not. 
Do you, do you see, Jose Salvador, do you see why? Well, the, the other word is, is she is single. No, she is, pero in the, in the, in the, in the ask word for me, it's important that not, she is not single. But the answer is no, she is single. So okay. it's impossible for the question ah, yes. to be, is she I, single? I know this. The panel's the question number six. Yes, I'm sorry, okay. depend, depend what? What's the question number six? Are you married? Oh yes, yeah, question number six. Are you married? Yes, I'm married. Is she single? I'm sorry, is she married? No, she is single. Yes. I or guess. yes, she is married. Okay, do you understand? Yes, I understand. Yes. All right, good. Now we're going to practice something. Please hold on. Please give me one second. Okay. I'm sorry, do you see my screen? Yes. Okay, miren, yes. les voy a pedir un gran, gran favor, ¿ok? Ok. Les voy a enseñar el presente simple. Les voy a decir algo desde ya. Este es el tiempo más importante en el idioma inglés. ¿Por qué? Porque en una conversación se usa el 80% del tiempo. Yes? yes. So, please, I need you to understand. If you don't understand, please ask me a question, okay? Okay. 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 Now, English is not only past present and future it's not only three there are many many different presents we have we have present progressive we have present We have present perfect, etc. So look, they, they are all presents. Present, present, present. Do you see? Yes. So remember, today we're going to study simple present, not present. Present, no. Simple present. Okay, please remember this because it's the most the most important tense in English. What yes. is Why? what? I'm sorry. Why simple present and no alone present? Why not only present? Uh -huh. Okay, when when you understand three or four different presents, yes, you will understand why. Why. It, it needs to be simple because people people think that present is only now in this moment mm, okay. and it's and it's not okay okay but thank you good good question okay in your opinion what is simple present mm, yeah Excuse me. Yeah. So, Josué, um, 
What is simple present for you? Can you give me an example? Um, like something um, here, um, my glass. Okay, now look, one thing. Look at the name, simple present. Give me an example, but a simple example. Don't complicate yourself. I am a student. I am a student. Okay, okay give me another one, somebody. She works late. I, I, I am here. She works, okay, I'm sorry, Manuel, give me an example. I, I am here. I am here. Okay, Brenda, give an example. I am stood. I am stood. <clears throat> okay, Patty, give an example. Okay. Um, I am. Okay, no more I am. No more I am. Give me different okay. examples because simple present is not only I am. Because uh, if not, everybody says I am a student, I am a father, I am a brother, I am a sister, et cetera, et cetera. So it's infinitive. <laughs> give me different, give me more examples. Like for example, she works. Uh, yes, uh, she is at work, for example. She is at work. Yeah. She is at work. Okay, Judith, can you give me an example? They play. Excuse me? They play. They play. Okay. Yes. Um, I'm sorry, Manuel in Salvador, did you give me an example? She could soup the chicken. She cooks soup the chicken. Suto chicken. What's chicken? Jose, me está viendo algo en Google. No. Okay. She cooks what chicken? She she cooks suit of chicken. Suto chicken what soup, is soup, soup, soup and sopa oh chicken, chicken soup. soup chicken, chicken soup. soup yeah oh okay okay soup soup of chicken look suto chicken no it's chicken soup chicken soup can can you read this in spanish soup 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 I mean, this is the pronunciation, right? Soup of chicken soup. soup. Exactly. So can you repeat that, Jose? Okay. She cooks chicken soup. Excellent, chicken thank soup. you. Thank you, very good. Okay, first of all, we have to understand simple present is something Some thing we do. Okay, look, this is this is where I'm telling you that this is important. Okay, simple present is something we do in present time not in this moment. Please, please remember that. Example, example, look, I like tequila. I drink tequila, but in this moment, I'm not drinking tequila. But in norm, in, normally on Fridays, maybe I drink tequila. Do you understand? Yes. Yeah. Okay, only two people understand. Thank you, Patty and Judith. So Josue, Daisy, Manuel, and Brenda, you don't understand? Yes. Okay, thank you. Please yeah. say yes. I, I need you because if you don't ask questions, you will get confused. I don't understand. 
Okay, something we do as a habitual action. So what is a habitual action? Every day, every week, every month. Okay, let's start with this, look. Every day, Brenda, tell me something you do every day. I'm cooking every day. Okay, very good, thank you. I cook every, every day. That was an excellent example, Brenda, thank you. Are you cooking in this moment? No. Okay, good, so it's not present continuous. Simple present is I cook every day. Every day. Okay? Okay. Yes. Yeah. All right. Um, tell me something you do every week. Every week. Um, tell me something you do every week. I work. I work. I, 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 we work every week. Very good. We work every week. I, I go to the supermarket every week. All right. Yeah. Very good. Um, what is another habitual action every day, every week? What else? Uh, I clean my bathroom every week. Excellent. Thank you, Patti. Okay, give okay. me give me another example. Every week, let's say every month. Well, uh, Judith, what is something you do every month? Is um, I visit the supermarket. You visit or you go? I go. The supermarket. Good. I go to the supermarket. Yes. Yeah, because look, visit is only two things. Okay. Something important or pleasure. Okay, because you, visit, when you say I visit is for two things. Something important, like I need to visit the doctor, the dentist, or pleasure. Like, oh, yeah, or pleasure. Oh, I'm going to visit my girlfriend. Yes. Okay. But yes. you don't, you don't, you don't visit a supermarket. You go to the supermarket. Yes. Yes. ¿Sabe cuando visita un supermercado? Si un día va a Japón. Porque lo va a hacer como en tono turístico. Hey, I want to visit the supermarket. <laughs> para ver todo lo que tienen vendiendo. Yes. Pero yes, visit, yes. visit es como más como placer o una cita. Dentist. Yeah. I need to visit the dentist. I need to visit my family in the hospital. Okay. Josué Sandoval, can you tell me something you do? Yes. Wait, wait. Let me see. Let me see. Tell me something you do three times a day. Three times a day. Um, do you, I'm sorry, class, do you understand three times a day? Yes. Yeah. Very yes. good. All right. All right, Josue, so tell me, what is something you do three times a day? Mm, Eat. Clean my teeth. I brush my teeth. Ah, uh, brush. Yes. My teeth. I brush my brush teeth me. three times a day. Good. Yes. I eat three times a day. Josue, tell me something you do every year 
and bring it here. Um, celebrate. What the hell? Um, okay, I celebrate, right? I celebrate my birthday. All right. I celebrate my birthday every year. Good. Hilda, are you there? Okay, let me see. Brenda, are you there? Yes. Brenda, can you tell me something you do every Sunday? Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Um, verano. Excuse me? Verano, verano. Sunday. No, Sunday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, yes. Sunday. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, First? Um, I... Uh, I go to the very late cinema every Sunday. I don't know. I go okay. to the cinema. Very good. I go to the cinema every Sunday. Some people can say I go to church every Sunday. Yes. I eat sopa de pata every yes. Sunday and pupusas. Okay. Uh, some people, tamales. <laughs> some people say, hey, I visit uh, my family every Sunday. Okay. But do you see, do you see what I'm saying here? Simple present is something we do and a habitual action. Let me move. Something we do. Habitual action. Yes. And, and what is the habitual action? What we're doing in this moment every day, every week. Every year, hey, incluso every two minutes. Let me see, let me see. Ilda, are you there? Yes. Tell me, what do you do every two minutes? Every five minutes? I see my children. Huh? I see my baby. My baby. Every five minutes. <laughs> hey, some people are addicted. Some people say, hey, I check my Facebook every five minutes or I check my cell phone every five minutes. No? I check yes. my, my cell phone. Don't say no. <laughs> I check my cell phone every five minutes. No, no. But do you understand every five minutes? Yes. yes. Okay. Okay, so very good. Um, Manuel, so can you explain to me what is simple present? Uh, simple present is uh, something we do. Okay. Or habitual. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it, it, you know, this is the same. Something we do, habitual action. So, or we can say a habitual action we do. Okay, but so remember the most important thing here is that simple present is not in this moment. Okay? Okay. I want, I want you to look at this. Are you, do you see my screen? Yes. Do you see here, it says, I brush my teeth three times a day. Yes? Yes. Do you yes. see here, I celebrate my birthday every year? Yes. yes. Do you see, I go to the cinema every, every Sunday? Yes. Yes. Good. Do you see, I check my cell phone every five minutes? Yes. Okay. These are the examples you gave me. What do they have in common?
What do you see uh -huh. here in common? Sorry, I don't understand. Um, the verb is and and to form nativa. Okay, that's one. I'm sorry, Daisy. Daisy, you don't understand. Okay, alguien me dijo I don't understand. I think it's Daisy. La última, la última parte no le entendí. ¿Qué estaba yes? explicando? No. I... Explico, todos lo, los conceptos sí los comprendo. Okay. Pero lo, el, el momento es el que usted no le entiende. ¿Qué tienen en común estas cinco? Cuatro cosas, cuatro oraciones. Que son cosas que hacemos habitualmente. Es ¿eh? okay. ok, good, good. Very good. Ahora, gramaticalmente, what do you see here in common? The bird is person. The bird is person. Very good, yes. The verb is in present, but more in common is you say I, the verb, and the complement. We don't say I am. We don't say I was. We don't say I do. It's simply I, the verb, and the complement. One more time. I brush my teeth three times a day. The verb is brush. I celebrate my birthday every year. I go to the cinema every Sunday. I check my cell phone every five minutes. Do you see there? I, the verb, and a compliment? Yes, 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 yes. All right. We can Daisy? Use with a second person. <laughs> okay. Uh, question. The in other this person? moment, in this, oh, wait, that's next. I need you to understand I first. Yes, yes. Okay, good. No, no, no me voy a mover a he, she, we, they, si no tenemos I. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Yes. All right, cool. So, I, the verb, and the complement. Now, look, I drink, I drink maybe, maybe six cups of coffee. Do you, do you understand this? Yes, yes, yes. I drink six cups of coffee a day. Yes. What is, um, Josue, what is the habitual action here? Tomar café. <laughs> no, that's the action. I drink. Ah, so, bebe, sí, tomar tomar is, café. Soy copa de café. Okay, seis tazas de café. A day. <laughs> idea. That's the habitual action. Okay, very good. Okay. Le voy a explicar algo bien rapidito. No, por favor, por favor, no vayan a decir mañana. Si alguien le pregunta, hey, ¿qué tal tu clase ayer? Ah, bien, vimos el presente. No. Vimos el presente simple. Simple presente. Si ustedes salen ahorita a la calle y le preguntan a alguien, hey, ¿qué es el presente? Todos le van a decir lo mismo. O sea, algo en este momento. Porque lo, lo relacionamos, right? Eh, creo que José me preguntó por qué no solo se dice el presente. Yes. Le voy a dar un ejemplo. Yo como, yo estoy comiendo, yo he comido, yo habré comido. Todos esos son presentes. Y muy, muy diferentes. Pero son presentes. Sí. sí. Uh -huh. Aquí yo digo, I drink six cups of coffee a day. Yo bebo seis tazas de café al día. No estoy diciendo estoy bebiendo. Ese otro tiempo lo vamos a ver después de ese. Ok, do you understand? Yes. Ok, yes. now, let's make the question. Yes. What do you Okay, so look. 
it says here, this is how you make the question, okay? What do you, the verb, the and the complement? Very simple. So let's, let's do an example. What do you, let's do the verb eat. Eat for, Okay, so look, it says, this is how you make the question. What do you, the verb and the complement? So let's do it. What do you eat for breakfast every day? Do you understand? Yeah. 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 Yes. Yes. All, all right. Thank you. So what do you eat for breakfast every day? Daisy? Uh, Manuel, what do you eat for breakfast every day? Uh, I I eat um, beans, um, bread, and coffee. Okay, excellent. <laughs> okay, for. Is this correct? Manuel said, I eat beans and bread for breakfast every day. Is this correct? Judith, you say no. Why? Sorry, sorry. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm more verb, more compliment. Yes. So it is correct. I, the verb, and the complement. Remember, the complement is the habitual, the habitual, so every day. Okay, very good. Thank you, Manuel. Okay. Patty, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, Patty, let me see. Do you see my, my question here? It says, what do you watch on TV? Every night. Yeah. Uh, I watch um, I watch CNN International every night. Oh, good. Is this correct, class? Yes. Okay. She said, I watch CNN every night. Let's check, is this correct? Yes, because it's I, the verb, and the complement. Quiere decir que siempre en el complemento va a detallar el momento en general, como exactly. cada día. Yes. Mm -hmm. Esta semana, algo así. El momento habitual. Porque si yo digo, Brenda, what do you eat tonight? Uy, uh, estoy siendo específico, tonight. Yesterday, specific, no. So I say every night because simple present is a habitual action. Okay, Daisy? Thank you, thank you. Okay. Jose, are you there? Yes, please. Oh. Okay, Judith. Hi. Hi. Judith, we're going to change what and we're going to put where, okay? Okay.
Okay, it says, where do you buy your clothes? I... Normally. <laughs> I buy, boy, sorry, boy is, is boy. Okay, the I buy. Hi. I buy my clothes. Mm -hmm. Normal in San Jack. Okay, good. I buy my clothes. Normal. St. Jack's. ¿Qué le pregunté aquí, Judith? Where do you buy your clothes normally? ¿A dónde compro mi ropa normalmente? Ok, good. Muy bien. No le pregunté a dónde compró su ropa, a dónde la va a comprar, sino que normalmente a dónde la compro. Good. ¿Dónde la compro? Y me dijo, I buy my clothes in St. Jack's. Ok, ¿entendieron esto? Yes. Ok, mañana lo vamos a hacer con lo que me estaban diciendo, tercer persona, he, she, we, they. No se las quise hacer hoy porque obviamente lo más importante primero es aprender I. Porque no va a cambiar nada mañana, lo que va a cambiar solo es el pronombre. Aquí va a ir you, oops, you, he, she, we y they. Ok, eh, como les repito, pónganle mucha atención a este tiempo porque es presente simple y la palabra lo, lo dice, es el, la forma más simple del, del tiempo presente. O sea que hay más complicados. Pero ¿por qué es simple? Porque es algo que simplemente es algo que hago. Yes. 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 Ok. Eh, es algo que hago habitualmente. Y acuérdense que el habitualmente no solamente es, puede ser todos los días, todos los dos sábados, todos los domingos, etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. ¿Ok? Ok, thank you, thank you very much. Mañana, mañana, hoy me faltaron como cuatro o cinco, creo. Mañana van a estar bien confundidos. Entonces necesito a ustedes que me ayuden a explicarles. Okay. Okay. So thank yes. you very much and you have a great day. I will see you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Good night, everybody. Good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night.